welcome to Carl. Like I don't see a podcast where we talk about movies, mm. comics, games, sports, mm. and fast food streaming services. I am GP. What's up? What's up? Chicken. <laughs> Chicken on the TV. What's up? The guy is AD. Hey, you know that Charlotte Claire song? Yeah. Sun don't shine, sun don't shine. Anyway, yeah. what's up, y'all? <laughs> <laughs> what up, peoples? How you doing, GP? What up, Frank? <laughs> what up, Frankie Frank? Frank said he's going to take an early leave today, so he's going to clock out like half shift. All right, that's cool. Which is great. All that's right. no problem. Yeah. I love leaving early from work, too. Right? Yeah. It must be nice. Mm-hmm. Must be nice. He's got plans on a Saturday. Must it's Labor be. Day weekend. Must be nice with the family. <laughs> yeah. We're not taking no days off here, though. The podcast yeah. keeps going. <laughs> yeah, yeah. This is a real. This is the realest job we have. Mm-hmm. In our life mm-hmm. <laughs> What's up, man? How are your week, man? Uh, my week was okay. Um, it rained. Did it rain mm-hmm. by you? Mm-hmm. Yeah, you got some. Praise the Lord. <laughs> <laughs> I told you last week, dog. It was a burnt. <laughs> as soon as the rain fell on my shit, it was like turned into Pride Rock. A circle of life. <laughs> the zebras are coming back. <laughs> There's life again in the front of my house. Oh, the animals are bowing in front of us. <laughs> it's so crazy how that, that bit of rage just like got everything back like sm- like slightly greener than before i was like yes wow. keep yeah. that up yeah <laughs> my um, water bill thanks you i was watching this i was watching a classic man i was watching Bowfinger uh uh-uh. this week and i was cracking up laughing about that i haven't seen um, that movie in a minute yeah it's a it's a good classic uh did you fi- did you watch started watching uh batman cape crusader yet oh no that's out yeah what what's that on max <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I did. Wa- I binge watched all ten episodes. Oh God, damn! You ain't tell me nothing. <laughs> you ain't tell me nothing. My bad, man. My Is bad. it good? <laughs> it, it's, it's 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 good. It's real, real retro and and mm-hmm. old school, which I like. So wow. All yeah. right, shit. All right, don't say nothing. I I, I got. I was about to do this. I'm not gonna say nothing. All right, but cool. I do. I heard that that Terminator Zero that we were talking about in Quick Bits. I heard that uh-huh. is like the Fire. best, the best thing, the the best Terminator thing for Ever. the Terminator series. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Yeah. That's a so, huge statement. Yeah. Okay. I, I, I'm thinking about watching that one. All right, stay tuned yeah. for that. We might have to review that soon. Yeah. I got to no problem. Right. <laughs> How was your week, sir? Uh, My week was beautiful, man. It was my birthday. My birthday. Yay. Yay. It's me. Sorry, I got like a kid with the balloons. Yeah, man, celebrated my birthday this week. It actually started like last Sunday. We celebrated, uh, my wife and I, we went out to Cheesecake Factory and mm. celebrated there. It was, I haven't been, I haven't been there in a minute, dog. And nice. You forget how extensive that menu is. I was like, dang, dog, there's li- literally so many things you could order on this menu. Right. And I always go for like the, the most simplest thing. I'm like, I get frustrated after a while. Like, you know what? You know what? Just give me the sliders. Dang, so many things. Of all but the I, options with the Cheesecake Factory, I don't know why dating these days, mm-hmm. so I heard, women don't like going to the Cheesecake Factory. Maybe it's been overused. Mm. We're, we're old school here. We don't I go. I don't. Hey, hey, I, I will go. I, don't, I go. I tear it up. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> we go right after the show. <laughs> <Go> right. <Yeah. laughs> Do the podcast with a cheesecake on the plate. <laughs> Get your wives. Let's go. <laughs> mm-hmm. No, but I had this uh, triple berry, triple berry cheesecake for the first time. Oh my goodness, man! Mm. It was like, it was like the perfect start to my birthday week, dog. And then uh, we celebrated at home, of course. Mm-hmm. Gifts and my sons were singing me birthday, uh, the birthday song, which is so <laughs> cute. Oh my god! To him, my little, my youngest one, Aiden, yeah. man, like he was. He was getting them pipes in, and I was like, yeah. "Damn, oh. bro, like, <laughs> did you, you record sing that? it for your daddy?" <laughs> no, I didn't. Oh, I was stuck in the moment, man. Oh. <laughs> I was like, I "Oh did. my god, he's <laughs> singing to me!" <laughs> my brain froze on just the moment, man. Yeah, it was yeah, amazing. yeah. Amazing. So yeah. I was, I was super thrilled, super touched by that. Yeah. And of course, my wife dropped a serious, like, make a ton gift on me. Nice. I got a Jordan Love 
jersey, baby. You got it. Packers, baby. Packers. <laughs> I got a Jordan Love jersey, number 10, baby. Yeah. I can leave, I can leave, I can leave. <laughs> Yo, you should have seen my face when I picked that thing out of the box. I was like, oh, <laughs> fully official. Like, oh, my God, with all the washing directions. So you know that shit is real. Like, don't yeah. iron this shit this way. You fold might have it to, this way. You might have to plaque that, man. Nah, I'm going to wear that after I plaque it? it. Yeah, I'll okay. probably plaque it after I see him win some Super Bowls. But for now, man, I'm rocking that every Sunday, dog. I was so hyped. I was not expecting that. I was not expecting that. That's so, cool. That's cool. She came through in the clutch. Freaking Jordan mm-hmm. Love, and you know what kind of season he had last year? <laughs> Packers, baby! <laughs> Football next week? Ooh! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Shit, man. Shit! <laughs> yeah, so uh, that was that was nice. And then my third grade team, we they like upped and said, hey, let's go celebrate. I was like, oh, snap! So we went out celebrating some teachers, too, um, mm-hmm. on Friday. Had a couple of drinks. And then... Like one of the teachers paid for all my stuff. I was like, "Dang, bro! Like wow. you ain't had to do that, but wow. thank you." Nice. It was good. It was dope, man. It was dope. And then yeah. to top it off, the cherry on the cake. Uh oh. Black Wukong. Black Wukong. <laughs> finally, finally downloaded it. Downloaded that bad boy, and we are on it. On it. Seriously, man, this game is D.O.P. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so dope. Mm-hmm. And I'm only like, what, 10 miles in? Like, <laughs> <laughs> yep. every corner you turn, ladies and gentlemen, it's just a boss. Sir. No, that yep. a boss. That's Beat a him boss. up. <laughs> Fight. <laughs> 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 every time I beat him with a stick. <laughs> 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 How you liking it so far though? We gotta probably save it for a full review, but we gotta save it for a review. Just give me a little snippet. Review, what do you think? What are you feeling so far? I'm digging it so far. It's and it's it's challenging, but I'm mm. digging it. I'm digging it, man. I'm digging the graphics. Mm-hmm. I got it playing in subtitles with Chinese language. <laughs> Which is refreshing, man. I've yeah. never played a game in Chinese before. Yeah. And I don't think Chinese China themselves have even have a hit like this before in gaming. So No, 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 no. This is a massive deal as to why this game is so like impactful right now. It's it's, yes. it's taking the gaming world by storm. But yeah, that that Chinese man and the the lore around everything. So much lore. Yeah. Oh my god. And I'm I'm actually reading, man. I'm like, let yeah, me, let me, yeah. Let me dive in. Yeah. Somebody say, you should have read the book. Shut up! I'm playing the game! <laughs> it's more fun this way. It's more fun this way. I'm not going to read no ancient Chinese book. I want to hear it in West. my head. <laughs> no! Journey to the PS5 is what I'm talking about, baby. Let's go. Shishui! Show us a more now, Shishui! Shishui, I'm getting here. Oh my god, yeah, man! I'm loving the fluidity of the combat too, and it definitely feels like a mix. I've seen articles saying it, but actually, from playing it now, I can see why they say this. Like mm-hmm. it's a mix between God of War and like Elden a Ring. Souls game. Yeah, like Elden Ring. Yeah. Like there's that guiding light thing that that comes up every now and then to tell you, you know, where you should be going. Yeah, uh, yeah. And I, I, you know, I me like, in Elden Ring, I had traumatic <laughs> flashbacks. I was like, is this, is this game gonna be hard, guys? Is this what I'm not gonna beat? <laughs> I think it's gonna be hard, man. I think it's gonna be challenging the yeah. further you get into. It. Yep, but it it's a decent challenge and it's beatable, right? It's winnable fight so far. Yes. Right? Uh-huh. It's not like you can't, it's not like you play in 20 hours and it's like, man, I still haven't beaten this one boss. I'm looking at you, Elden Ring. Mm-hmm. So it's a it's more manageable. And then it has the God of War elements where, you know, he has the dodging stuff and right. the chests on the side and the, the the skill tree set up. I'm like, all right, this is this is very much like a monkey Kratos right mm-hmm. now. So armor. But yeah. we should not we should stop talking because yeah, we're going yeah, into, yeah, we're, we're going into review going territory. Into a full ass review. Yeah, yeah, we are. But yeah. Woo-ha, let's go. Yes. <laughs> so that was my week, bro. Yes. <laughs> that was my week. freaking amazing. Uh all right, let's get back, man. Call out. Boom, 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 boom. <laughs> what are you pissed about this week? Jim? Okay, I am calling out Ludacris. That's Luda, right. I'm calling out mm. Ludacris. What happened? Ludacris uh, went to 
Alaskan glaciers and drunk out of the glacier. Mm. He took. Oh a, yeah, I saw that. He was yeah. drinking like glacier water, right? Yes, it's on unfiltered glacier water. Right. So you're drinking from you don't know what kind of organisms, Mm-mm. viruses, Mm-mm. diseases that's just inside that. Just chilling in that pool. Yeah. It's, it's very deceptive. It is yeah. very deceptive. You might think, you might think, oh, he, he drunk the oh, this is the best water I ever had. Maybe because it's cold. <laughs> Just that, that's it. The cold it's is the, covering up the fact the cold that you is taste, covered up. Yeah, and you it's, have slimy ass bacteria that's in right, your mouth. Right, right, right. Just because <laughs> it's clear water doesn't mean nothing's in it. <laughs> <laughs> right? No, that's a good point. People will be like, oh my God, it's so freshing. Look, I want to bottle it up. No, right. you need nah. that shit to go through at least nah. a filtrate. Yeah. Before you dive on in, because that ice holds so much dirt. Like, yeah, that's, there's a lot of animal doo doo in that water, baby. Yeah, that's 25 times, 25 <laughs> times bicentennial <laughs> years we're talking about of dirty water. Fossilized dead animals in there. You drank some old dinosaurs like crap. <laughs> this you, you, is gross. You, you, you eating at least ten percent of dinosaur toenails now. Mm. Come on. Uh, ew. Exactly. <laughs> See. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> exactly. Right. That's ludicrous. <laughs> 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 yeah oh man yeah but so, so you call him out for drinking the water i'm calling him out for drinking the water i'm ju- literally showing him drinking the water and thinking that it's he's cool. perfectly fine this is yeah, yeah come on man nah, nah. i want to see the after effect of the he not he <laughs> and, I, and knowing ludicrous he will not show the after effect even if no. he was sick he'd be like i'm perfectly fine yo in the bathroom yeah, just do doing out his guts but i can extend that call it out because there's been people around like on tiktok and instagram reels right that's been showing like those travelers and they go to alaska and these places and they're like just putting the the, the cup full on submerged taking right. it out and ah, i'm like right. you have a boiling thing of fu- like a, a little fire in the back you don't want to boil that out first before you drink it yeah like come like on, boi- at least boil it <laughs> at least <laughs> At least boil it and then right. refrigerate it, and then you can drink it afterwards. Yeah, you want it cold, put it back in the freezer. There you they go. don't want they they think just because everywhere looks around is blue, it's white, everything's clean and clear. Like nah, man, that's right. not the case. That's dirty ass water you just drank. Sir. That's like if if I went to the Grand Canyon and and, and brought a rock home and started mm-hmm. nibbling on it. <laughs> What you doing? Exactly. What are you doing? <laughs> See? It's a clean rock. No, it's not. <laughs> that's, a, that's, a, that's a rock. <laughs> no, it no, looks no. so clean by the wind. The wind takes care of the bacteria. No, the wind doesn't do shit with the bacteria. Ew. Nibbling on a six million year old rock. <laughs> that's gross. It's so good. So good. Rock nuggets. <laughs> Canyon nuggets. He got a bag full of that shit. He just <laughs> popping them in his mouth. What they call? Canyon nuggets. C- Canyon nuggets. <laughs> <laughs> Come get you some Canyon nuggets. Nature is tasty, baby. I got Canyon nuggets here. I got glacier water in my glass, man. <laughs> Ooh, my body going to be feeling fantastic tomorrow. <laughs> we gather here today to remember. <laughs> the adventurer that he was, he did not know that drinking glacier water and eating the Grand Canyon is not a good combination. We remember you as being ridiculous and ludicrous. <laughs> Look, Pastor, get somebody to play a final episode of Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> For what? <laughs> For no reason. For what? It's just what I wanted. It's what he wanted. It's what he wanted. (laughs) That does make no sense. Oh, my God. Yes. Yeah. Good call out there, man. Yes. Yes. I mean, come on, man. Got to be better. Come on, man. Yeah, man. That's that's not cool. Yeah. What else? What else? That's that's all I got. That's all I got. That's all you got? All right, man. Um, This week, I'm not angry. Mm -hmm. I'm not angry at anything, G. I'm actually happy. Okay. Yeah, I'm yeah. happy this week. Yeah, my birthday week, man. I had nothing yeah. to be upset about. So you have no, no call it outs. You can call me out for not having a call out. <laughs> <laughs> I'm happy. <laughs> I'm happy. 
I just had a lot of good stuff happening. I'm like, I just, I just can't find myself to be angry or anything right okay, now. Okay, okay. Not hey, even a drive, is... not even a Houston driver pissed me off this week, and I was shocked. I'm like, normally I get at least forty of those right. by Thursday, yeah, that I could use, but yeah. <laughs> I, I, I have nothing. Forty different license plate numbers, yeah. <laughs> Written. Oh, how'd you know? Because I, <laughs> I keep receipts. <laughs> BS. I got you. <laughs> Toyota <laughs> Corolla <laughs> Yeah, no, I'm good, man. I'm I'm good. So uh yeah. Okay. But I was happy to join in on yours though. Thanks right. for <laughs> Thanks for bringing that to the table. <laughs> All right, oh, let's all right. Uh, move on. We do got some interesting topics, though. How about that? Yes, we do. We can talk, we can talk about that. Mm-hmm. Um, all right, first one. This one's going to cut a little bit painful here. For sure. Uh, continuing with the new weird sports. We did it last week, so we're doing it this week. Uh, talking about one very weird one called nose pulling. Nose pulling. Yes. Oh, God. Where two players sit back to back in a chair <laughs> with a string that goes around both players over both of their noses. And basically, whoever can pull their face forward and make the other player tap out wins. Oh mm. Yeah. Mm. And this was a, 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 a Olympic sport, right? Was it? It's. I think it's a certain place for the, the Olympic sport. But yeah. I have never seen that in the Olympics in Me my neither. life. Me neither. I gotta look that one up, but Me yeah, that neither. thing is definitely painful. When you look at this video, folks, this man's face, yeah, and the this string, it looks like it's breaking his nose as he's doing this thing, yeah. And it, you could actually see the skeletal frame in in its completion of the nose, like yeah. how the nose is formed. The whole point tip point of his nose mm-hmm. gone. Yeah, I'm he looking, like, dog. He looking like a character straight out of Wild Thornberries. Yeah, he does. (laughs) (laughs) Darling. (laughs) Nigel. (laughs) Sorry, he looked like Nigel. Yeah, he looked like his name is Nigel, yeah. But yeah, it it looks seriously painful, man. The blood, the the redness of the nose, his face was like uh, all misshapen. Yeah. I didn't, and then I'm looking at the video. I'm like, what? At, where's the other guy's face? Like, how's he doing? Exactly. <laughs> did, he, did, he, did he win? <laughs> did, he, did he die? Right. Like, God, did he get his nose chopped off? <laughs> he broke his nose into it up into his brain, and it shattered. That was it for the player. <laughs> yeah, man. I don't know what would possess people to do this kind of sport. Last week we had the the karjutsu, right? right? And now yeah. this one with yeah. the nose pulling. My yeah. goodness. I can see karjutsu. But this one, ah, pretty far fetched. A test of how much pain you could take. I tell yeah. you, I'd last. I probably last about three seconds. That's it. I, yeah. Ah, yeah. Ah! yeah. Without allergies, we won't be able to compete, man. Can we go? Oh else? my! It's <laughs> not gonna be coming all out of our nose. Trying- <laughs> now I have a sense. Now that you mentioned that, I have a sensitive nose. Like any right, like, yeah. Un- like unexpected flicker hits my nose, I'm gonna start sneezing. Right. So, so imagine right. it's pulling against my exactly, nose, yeah. and I'm sneezing. On my, right. I might actually win though. That might actually be my superpower. Maybe kind of you might you might sneeze right? and pop the <laughs> pop the sneeze, string. Sneeze so much that it, it pulls against the other guy. And he can't yeah. take it anymore because right. the force of the sneeze is pulling the string harder. Yeah. <laughs> and I can't stop. So the more he pulls, this is my chakra. This is my nose chakra. <laughs> so the more that he pulls, the more I sneeze, it makes it worse for him. How yeah. do you? Beat that. You cannot beat me. She is a It's the Steve's master. That's <laughs> your ass. Yo, you think I'll say you disqualify? <laughs> he keeps I'm sneezing. Not my, and now my falls, my fucking nose is stuck like this. <laughs> it's a sinuses. <laughs> My son, I can't do this. Every time I try to play this game, it's not the best part for me. Well, stop pulling so hard! Stop looking at shit! Dude, every, every time I watch this, this it looks like uh, if someone knows is getting cut off like like knives cutting a cake. Uh, yeah. Oh, my God. Yeah, it looks painful. That's yeah, it does, does, man. Yeah. Ah. Uh. Yeah. And it's only I, I want to see like the 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 after effects of this like that guy had a deep ass imprint on his face yeah yeah from the string mm-hmm. you know 
Yeah. And wh- wh- is he going to come back like the following day and play again? Like, what's the time frame for right. these matches? Right. Like, yeah. I'm pretty sure you're sore on your nose for at least two months with that. God yeah. dang. For real. That is crazy. And then yeah. the next thing that popped in my head was like, yo, what if there's like levels to it? Like one level one is string, right? right. <laughs> level two is like cable wire. <laughs> like <laughs> tree branch. <What? laughs> Chains. So then, then, oh my goodness! The, this is an easy one for novices. Like there's dental floss. Like right, yeah. you wrapped up big ass dental floss about two people. Right. I probably could get in on that competition. Yeah. yeah. But the cable wire, no. I <laughs> they slice both their faces in half. Right. Mess around, floss your teeth while you're doing it. <laughs> Not with cable wire though. That's no, no, that's no, flossing no, your no, face no, no. off. No, no, no. Yeah. That's seriously on some saw shit. Yeah. And then for the most extreme, barbed wire. <laughs> How much pain can you endure with barbed wire around your face? You're going to have plastic surgery on the ready. Good mm-hmm. for that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. Painful. Painful. Mm-hmm. Give it a look, folks. Look it up. It's it's not easy to watch. The guy looked like he was done with life afterwards. He was just like, his head was down. He's like, why did I do this? Why? why? And he was tearing, too. Like, he was crying. But yeah. you're trying not to succumb to the pain. It's kind of like that freaking Dune shit with the hand. Right, like imagine in Dune three, it's the nose pulling tournament. Right, yeah. <laughs> Pull on your nose, hard. They pulling noses on top of the worms. Some ancient, some ancient uh, scientific planet, <laughs> the Jufari. This is planet Jufari, where they pull noses. <laughs> We're not like sand people. We pull noses here. <laughs> that knife fighting shit. That's old school. This. This is the real deal. Don't shed no tears when you pull <laughs> the nose. Put your nose, put the string around your nose. <laughs> Why? Don't ask questions, boy. <laughs> Just do it. What will happen to me? <laughs> if you flinch, <laughs> this needle is going to go into your neck. <laughs> now pull. I am Paul Atreides. <laughs> I lost my nose. And I'm going to lead you to the promised land. <laughs> what? This, way, this way over here. <laughs> to the promised land. Follow me. <laughs> I didn't understand. I didn't catch that last line. I'll to the promised me. To the promised land. <laughs> Can you hear me? To the promised land. <laughs> Oh, man, I squeezed my nose so much I felt like I was in that damn fight. <laughs> no, yeah, let's keep it Let's keep it moving here. Let's keep it moving, for but sure. Yeah, call yeah. it there. Mm-hmm. Check it out. You know, TikTok, look at it. It's ridiculous. Human mm-hmm. beings, what else are we going to do next? Yes. Huh? Mm. Maybe next week we'll do like a pinky pulling competition. Who else <laughs> Who else can break their pinky and, and, and not cry? Or oh, man. <laughs> Who could break their pinky off and eat it? What? <laughs> Just wash it down with some glacier water, baby. <laughs> this is good. It's called cannibal break. <laughs> <laughs> it's an Olympian sport. It's a new sport. It's a new sport. You don't know about it. Cannibal break. Oh, God. Let's move on. All right. Let's move on. All right. So, speaking of ridiculous, man. <laughs> yes. Chick fil A. Chick fil A. The Chick fil A, the chicken place, the fast food place, mm-hmm. right? Yeah. They are aggressively moving into the entertainment space. Uh oh. Lord knows why. With plans to launch a slate of originals for its own streaming platform. That's right. <laughs> wow. They're getting, getting ready to stream. Mm. <laughs> Something else that you're gonna pay nine eighty nine for <laughs> streaming. You can stream us, or you can go grab a chicken sandwich. Your choice. <laughs> nine eighty nine go, plus a nugget. <laughs> I'm gonna go with the. I'm gonna go with the sandwich. Thank you. So they've been working with a number of major production companies, including some of the studios, <coughs> to create family friendly shows. Mm. <laughs> it's wow. also it talks to, to license and acquire content. So it's very much in the beginning phases of uh, starting up their streaming services. Okay. All right. So. Yeah. Mm-hmm. They uh, it it includes family friendly game show from Glassman Media, the company behind NBC's The Wall, mm-hmm. and Michael Sugar's Sugar Twenty Three, which is a ser- this behind series such as Netflix Thirteen Reasons Why. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so mm-hmm. ah, look out for that. Yeah, budgets are expected to believe in the range of four hundred thousand per half hour. So you know the 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 idea is to launch later this year. 
and talked of scripted projects and animation. <laughs> what? Chicken animated. <laughs> It'd be Sasha's party. Three. <laughs> Food related stuff. Chicken running around with the heads cut off. <laughs> what is going on on this damn streaming service, man? Welcome to Chick fil A! Chick fil A! Chick fil A! You could buy a chicken sandwich and cotton all in one place. Exactly. It, was it that's that, that cow that's on there for their little uh, yeah. co- commercials? Yeah. Eat more, eat more chicken. Yeah, <laughs> there's a whole show about that. It's a freaking it's four seasons of telling us to eat more chicken. Yeah, they gonna have a reality show called Fast Food Manager Wives. Mm. <laughs> what do you mean you're firing me? I'm the best grill master you got. <laughs> I've been here on this grill a long time. All right, get ready to lose customers because I'm gone. <laughs> they cut to the guy. It's, you know, it's never easy running these kind of businesses, you know. <laughs> you got chicken product. You got to deal with the fries are coming in. Or new sauce is coming up. We got to have everything tip-top shape. Stay tuned for episode four. <laughs> <laughs> like, yo, did you see that episode? <laughs> Fast food housewives, bro. <laughs> Chick Fil A got the good shit. You talking about them food? No, this shows, man. This shows be off the chain. Nigga, that Chick Fil A. You ever seen that one? <laughs> Yo, they got this new anime out called The Golden Nugget. What? Yeah, The Golden Nugget. Isn't that a slots place? No, man. Not in the Chick Fil A streaming services. No, not in the uh, Chick Fil A stream. It's an anime. It follows one golden chicken, and he's. Uh, <laughs> He's out to get revenge. <laughs> he's, he's, he, they killed his family. <laughs> they took the, he took all his eggs, turned them into scrambles, and uh, he's he's been pissed off ever since. They go have the daytime soap opera called "Who Ate My Chicken Sandwich." <laughs> boom, 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 Samantha, boom, 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 I promise you, I didn't. I didn't eat your sandwich. Don't lie to me. <laughs> All right, Samantha, all right. Did you have to put sweet sriracha sauce on the sandwich, too? You bastard. I hate you. It was calling me, all right? I couldn't do anything about it, all right? Next week on... (laughs) Who ate my chicken sandwich? Who ate my chicken sandwich? <laughs> you didn't eat your canyon rocks like yo. <laughs> <laughs> this is <Yo>. good. <laughs> <laughs> it's really good. Hi, <laughs> 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 hey, Martin. What? You you seen this chicken chick fil A shit? <laughs> <laughs> What that on Netflix? Not Netflix, you idiot! You heard of the new screaming service? It's Chick Filler. Chick Filler. Yeah, yeah. Boy, what is it good? It's really good. <laughs> it's got Chick Fil A sports too. This shit's chicken crazy, baby. Woo. <gasps> chicken poultry. sandwich crazy. <laughs> this is got me poultry nuts. This shit's good. <laughs> Oh my god. A whole bunch of random crap that's for no reason right. that you're paying this money for. Instead Chick-fil-A. of law and order, it'd be law and nuggets. <laughs> don't, don't, chicken nugget. Chicken nugget. <laughs> no, man, you made me think back to that movie, dude. That animated movie with Sean DeClaire, the, the Rooster. Yeah, you remember yeah, that yeah. one? Cock a doodle. Yeah, cock a doodle. Yeah. <laughs> that, that's it. That's it. They show that shit every day. <laughs> cock a doodle, what a day. <laughs> so does Shad <Shatter> Bradley. <laughs> Sun do shine, sun do shine, sun do shine, sun do shine. Every Saturday they gonna play that one. Chick fil A, Chick fil A, Chick fil A. But told me how to play, not how to eat everything. Chick fil A, Chick fil A, Chick fil A. That's gonna be the only animated show, movie that they got, and they gonna play that on a constant. 
Hey, nigga, make that shit a whole new series, nigga. <laughs> bring it back. Make a whole new Reboot. series. Kind of do that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> man, Sean DeClaire's back, baby. <laughs> Channel mutant nuggets oh, facing man. the other mutant nuggets for a battle of supremacy. <laughs> oh my god! I hope it doesn't spark some next random crap where now every fast food is gonna start competing. Right? Oh man, McDonald's yeah. McDonald's looking for a streaming service right, next. Yeah, yeah. Freaking Popeyes, I have a streaming service oh, next. Like, what the hell is going on? Sweet heat, <laughs> heat. <laughs> <laughs> Sweet heat, heat. That's the show. <laughs> that's oh the show. <laughs> well, that's the after hours. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's the after hours. The Chick Fil A, Chick Fil A after dark. Yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> What's that chicken doing? Is it spicy? Ooh, that chicken is spicy. He on the pole! She on the pole! <laughs> she can slide it down the pole. <laughs> pole should be sliding, baby. She doing splits. That's a French cut. Oh my god. She got crows all over that pole. <laughs> Look at the thighs! <laughs> <laughs> Look at the breasts! <laughs> you stop! stop. <laughs> this had the most twisted image. <laughs> Some <laughs> raw ass chicken dancing on me. <laughs> that is disgusting. Oh Jeez. my god. This is what happens when you come up with these stupid ideas. <laughs> Our imagination run wild. Oh, man. All right. Like a chicken without a head. That's what happened just now. Yeah. That's exactly what yeah, happened. Yeah, yeah. That's exactly that's what the, happened. <laughs> that's their horror show. Yeah, chicken without yeah, a head. Yeah. It's a headless chicken. Dancing on a pole. <laughs> come on, man. But I Stop. swear we killed it. I swear we killed it. <laughs> it's coming back. <laughs> <laughs> It's gonna hit eight, me. eight episodes. <laughs> Season one out now. Oh my god! Stay tuned. Oh man, you know what? I'm, I don't know if I want to. I'm gonna probably just try like the free trial subscription, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just to see what it is exactly, so we can come and crap on it the next week. Oh, for sure. Oh man, for sure. Oh, dad. Thank you, Chick Fil A. Thank yeah. you. <laughs> giving us good material here. Yeah, this is what the world does. Yeah. <laughs> Cockadoo for the day. Shot the clown. That's a new mascot. Chicken fillet oh, mascot. Sadusha. 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 Damn. <laughs> And chicken Run. Also, we forgot Chicken Run too, man. That yeah. with Mel Gibson. Yeah. Oh yeah, Chicken yeah. Run to make a comeback on that for sure, dude. For sure, yeah. Oh, let's that's a go. Classic. Yeah. Whew. All, right, All right, that's enough of chuck ch- chicken around. Yeah. <laughs> Stop at the pole. Chucking sure. around. You see, Frank already left. There's a go- nope, yeah. That's his half day right there. You yeah. clocked out. You go. All see right. you next week, Frank. All right, Frank. Whew, let's call it right there today. <laughs> we got a mo. We got. My real, no real ass. My ass. <laughs> Sonic, Sonic yes. Three, mm-hmm. dropped the trailer. Ooh, yes, yes, baby, it's Ooh. good. It look good. <laughs> it really good. <laughs> Dog, this Ooh. that this Sonic franchise, I have been so thankful for. Like, yeah, man. By no means is this an Oscar worthy performance of anything. It's just straight entertainment. It's, it's, exactly. And but they it's just been so much fun to see these characters come to life, mm-hmm. quote unquote. Right. <laughs> and be used on the big screen like this. And now we, we got Shadow, my dude. Yes. Keanu oh Reeves. Oh my god. Yes. And he fit that I don't like does Keanu Reeves never suck? Like does he he just everything he does is amazing. 
Yeah, it's Keanu Everything Reeves, Everything Keanu man. Reeves does is amazing. My yeah. gosh. Mm-hmm. Why can't we vote for him for president? I'm pretty sure he'll fix right. the hell out of this country. Yeah. We need to put him as a... Um, we need to throw pedals at Keanu Reeves. You yeah, damn well. Oh, book that. Ah, oh, shit. Frank left. I'll write it down. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'll, I'll, I'll write it down. All right. <laughs> it's so hard to write. Anyway. Yeah. And it yeah, fits, he, his voice fits Shadow so well, man. Yes, man. Yes. You remember when Shadow first came on the scene in the gaming world? Like, that yeah. shit was major. Mm-hmm. Like, yo, it's a black Sonic. <laughs> <laughs> Ray, basically. <laughs> With a gun. <laughs> <laughs> and he's wearing some Jordans. <laughs> On a motorcycle? <laughs> oh, man. He's shooting people down. Nah, he's straight up from Brooklyn. <laughs> what? Wait, what? <laughs> how, did, how did we get here? <laughs> oh, man. But, yo, he has that chaos control thing, which I know is going to be nuts. Yeah, for sure. But the trailer chaos showed control. him fighting, um, you know, Knuckles. I don't know how Knuckles twisted his arm, and he twisted it in a direction that was okay. So. Right. That looked a little weird. They might fix that. Yeah. But <laughs> maybe they couldn't show his arm getting ripped off <laughs> in the trailer. Uh, but Dr. Robotnik, our guy. Uh, Jim Carrey. Jim Carrey, back, back in the game. Back at it. And he's also back as, uh, is it his dad? Is that his dad? I think it's his grandfather. I think His that's, grandfather? I think that's supposed to be the one who created Shadow. Yeah, yeah. But who is he in relation to Eggman? I Guess his grandfather. I, I think he said like "hello, son" or something in the trailer. I can't remember, uh, but he was in the games though, right? His in the game. I think his his character was dead, but they show mm. like glimpses of him okay. in the past. But yeah, okay. So yeah, I'm definitely gonna be watching this. Yeah, me too. For sure. Yeah, I'm definitely yeah. gonna be up in there. We gotta yeah. watch. We gonna yeah. watch that for sure. Mm-hmm. All right, moving on. We got next quick bit. Yep, yep. Uh, the next uh, Steve. Steve oh, oh Harvey. sorry. Go ahead. I'm sorry. Go ahead. <laughs> Jumping the gun. This is all right. Throw this piece of chicken at you. <laughs> I'm going to eat it. Steve. <laughs> <laughs> Steve Harvey. Yeah. <laughs> this is a Steve Harvey biopic coming out, y'all. Steve yeah. Harvey's going to have a biopic. I don't know what for, but. Mm. I mean, he has had a very successful life, so okay, maybe mm. maybe that's okay. But I'm kind of shocked, like he's having one, and we haven't had a Bernie Mac one yet. Yeah, right? for sure. Yeah, I'd say Bernie Mac deserves one sooner than Steve Harvey. Like Steve yeah. Harvey's still alive. Like yeah, Bernie Mac deserves one, but who can play Bernie Mac? Is the I know question. who can play Bernie Mac. Yeah, uh, he's he's from that he's from that comedy group, uh, yeah. RDC World. Mm-hmm. You know who I'm talking about. The main guy, the, the black guy. Um, he always does these anime uh, meme f- jokes and stuff, or, or the LeBron jokes. I'm 36. That guy. You've never seen him. Maybe I have, and I just can't yeah. You gotta think about you gotta look him up. You gotta look him up. Yeah. But yeah, he he like the way he talks sounds like a young Bernie Mac. Like he would definitely okay. fit that part. But okay. Steve do, Harvey, do, does I, he do more than one impression? Who the guy you talking about? I, I want to say impressions, but he's done like okay. um, yeah, yeah. he's done like uh, what's that coach name? Doc Rivers. He's made fun of. He's mm-hmm. made he's made he does like a lot of basketball reaction videos too. That's funny. Okay. okay. So yeah, he will definitely he will definitely fit the part. But for Steve Harvey, I don't yeah. know who would who's gonna play that. Yeah. You need that's gonna look weird. <laughs> yeah. Steve Harvey's face isn't really like common. <laughs> you know, it's like who's gonna pull off that that those big teeth? <laughs> that, that mustache. Thick ass mustache. Serve AJ? Mm, don't know. But yeah. yeah, stay tuned for that. We'll see once we get some more information on, mm-hmm. on that. Next quick bit. Next quick bit. Um the next Jurassic Park film will be called Jurassic World Rebirth. Oh god. Scarlett Johansson. Uh, Mahershala Ali. Uh, <laughs> That's what he's doing. He's not doing Blade. He's not doing Blade. He's stuck he's in freaking Jurassic one. Park. Like, <laughs> get your, get your, what, what? I'm, I'm not. I'm not even gonna say it. <laughs> get your, get so your, bad. Oh, oh. Yeah, so mad at him. What is Scarlett Johansson doing in a Jurassic Park movie? Like, I don't know. Come on, dog. I don't Jurassic know. World. I'm t- I, I'm, it's like what can't? What more can you do with? That franchise. Dinosaurs are dead. They are dead. <laughs> Just kill them, man. They died for a reason. <laughs> the asteroid hit the Earth to wipe out dinosaurs from making movies. You, you do, you're going to make that asteroid hit us again. Right. The same asteroid going to come back to Earth and be like, look, man, didn't I kill y'all? No, that's ludicrous for drinking that water. 
<laughs> I'm so sorry. These are all the signs. These are These all, the, are all signs. the signs. They kill dinosaurs for a reason, man. They don't belong on the big screen. They're, they're dead. Leave them alone. That's it, it. It was a good franchise while it lasted. Put it that way. Uh, like the, the Lost World was the best one. And then after that, it was just, okay, stop, stop, stop. Watch there be some new dinosaur here that they fuse together <laughs> on some freaking Romulus shit. Like, what? what? It's an alien? An alien dinosaur? Oh my god. A xenomorphosaurus? <laughs> hey. Hey, that might work. That good. <laughs> that sounds good. That sounds good. <laughs> that sounds horrible. That, that's that disastrous. Does. Yeah, exactly. A xenomorphed. Morphosaurus. Sounds chaotic. Yeah. They might pull oh. that. Who knows? <laughs> Marshall Ali pull out a blade to freaking try to kill a dinosaur. <laughs> oh, you could use a sword in this movie. Get your ass out of here! <laughs> I'm so tired of this franchise, man. I'm so tired of this franchise. I can't stand it. You can't roll you, with you this. Know, you know, like when you hear, you know, like you hear the certain theme songs. Like anytime I hear Jurassic World, Jurassic Park theme song now, I just hit skip. I just change the channel. <laughs> it's annoying. Like, bam, 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 bam. Ah, shut, shut up! Shut up! Oh, shut up! Shut up! <laughs> ain't nothing magnificent about you. Either. <laughs> they might as well put Jurassic, put this new Jurassic World Rebirth movie on that Chick Fil A streaming service. <laughs> Just put them there. Shit! <laughs> Damn, you ain't even make it to the big screen. You made it to Chick Fil A stream. <laughs> Only on Chick Fil A. You ain't even make it to Netflix. <laughs> you made it to fast food streaming service. That's where it belongs. I feel like that's where Chick Fil A can serve its purpose. Put all these crap movies that have no point. <laughs> just put them there. <laughs> that's where your money's at. Oh, put them God. there. Look, Borderlands. Because, <laughs> Borderlands, Borderlands gonna be on there. there. The this remake of there. The Crow. And then let's. Oh yeah. And then let's go to our next quick bit because it also belongs over there too. Yeah. This damn. <laughs> Peter Pan. <laughs> yes, a trailer for a Peter Pan horror film set oh. in the Pooniverse <laughs> has, has released called Peter Pan's Never Ending Nightmare. Oh God! Yeah, this is a Never Ending Nightmare. That's the perfect title. It's a Never Ending Nightmare. Why? Of Man. these crap ass movies. I still gotta watch those crazy uh, uh, Winnie the Pooh ones. So. The Pooniverse. The it's Pooniverse. It's scary, right? <laughs> <laughs> it's scary, isn't it? <laughs> This man, I don't know if y'all <laughs> seen this trailer or not. I don't care. This man looked like a fake. Like I was like, is that Heath Ledger's Joker? <laughs> what? Hello. Come with me to Neverland. <laughs> this is a. Uh, you know what they say? Shut the, what are you doing? <laughs> that is bad. You are not acting like this right now. Get off this bus. You know how I got these scars? Yeah, you're you're, you're freaky. <laughs> you're a freak. <laughs> Hook gave me these scars. Hook gave me these scars. I got in deep with the sharks. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> Why are you wearing a mask? I can't believe how they how they still doing these films, man. Because to green light something like this, man, it, right. it just looked like the latter half of the trailer was just a bunch of random ass people dying in gruesome ways, <laughs> right? It's yeah. not even scary stuff. It's it's and it's taking even the cliche. I don't know if that's the point. Like they're just making they just doing it to be cliche and stupid on purpose. I guess. But like some of the scares in the trailer look like scares you've seen in every other horror movie. Right. So it it's doesn't a looks original. More so yeah. a slasher, yeah. And then you see him like levitated. I was like, okay, <laughs> is he about to fly? Oh my god. Think about about to be some hoe. Like, what is going on? You be a rock star. Oh my gosh. You're she's a Tinkle Bell. You're a prostitute? <laughs> this movie's oh, messed up. Oh no, no, no. This messed up. No. Neverland is a van? <laughs> <laughs> what, what are we talking about here? This movie should be illegal, dog. This shit had so much like human trafficking inferences for no reason. I was like, yeah, man, this shit yeah, is I think twisted. It's a, it's a bad move. Bad move. With this that movie. is twisted. Y'all need to stop. Bad news for the Pooniverse. Yeah. The po- Can you stop saying that? <laughs> I was drinking. 
the Poonie verse. Yeah, send this Peter Pan movie over to Chick Fil A. They'll love you. They'll be glad to take it off your hands. Why every bad thing? Just send it over there. I'm trying to give it some a purpose here, G. I'm helping them out. Where are we gonna get our movies from? Right here. <laughs> Just pull it, pull it, pull it right here. Put it. Up, let people watch that crap. It's good. <laughs> 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 you know that Peter Pan shit wasn't that bad after all. He, he's pretty good. <laughs> oh my gosh! And that's it yes. for quick bits. Ooh. Yeah. All right, bring them out, right. bring them out, bring them uh, out, bring them uh. out. It's hard to yell when the verses is in your mouth. Pause. Verses. Wait, in your mouth. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. <laughs> we hey, got our girls. We got ourselves a <laughs> versus here, mm-hmm. folks. Yes, versus. We haven't had a versus on this on this show in a long time. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. It's been a while since we did a versus. Mm-hmm. It's been kind of peaceful. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so this week on our versus, mm-hmm. we're going big here. We're going BET uh-huh. versus MTV. Mm-hmm. And AD and GP yep. <laughs> will be talking BET <laughs> and MTV. And some other ADC with a BBC. <laughs> Do the BBC. Might be on NBC. <laughs> some other acronym. <laughs> on CNN, on ABC, <laughs> TBS. Or the PBB. On the CBS. Or the CFA. What's that? <laughs> Chick fil A, baby. That's the shit show this shit too. <laughs> Chick fil A. All right. All so right. the categories are yes for this versus we have our uh, better our better original shows, mm-hmm. better music countdowns. Mm-hmm. Oh, this is fun. Better original films, right? And th- who, which one of these had the better award shows? Mm. Lots to go through. Lots to dive in. For sure. Do we have any contributions before we start? No contributions. All right. We might have some contributions after we put the little sound bit out. Right. We, yep. we might. We might. Possibly. Yeah. All right. So. Here we go. Mm-hmm. Where do you want to start? Best original shows? Yeah, let's do shows. All right. Firstly, before we jump, I, I want to say these mm-hmm. two, you know, programming companies, like, top notch. Got us through our whole childhood, for the most part, into our yeah. pre-teens and partially of our adult lives. They've been around for a long-ass time. And also, um, honestly, they, got, they suck over the years. Yeah, 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 yeah. They both equally started to suck at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. But before they sucked, they were pretty damn good. Yeah, they for were sure. pretty damn yeah. So for the time mm-hmm. period that they're good, that's what that's what we're basing this list off of. Not right. for now. Right, right. Not right. from 20, 2012 or oh. twenty fourteen. Oh, yeah. oh Lord, no, oh, no. that shit belongs to Chick fil A shit. I ain't watch but I don't know. I don't even know what they look like now. For the early two thousands, we could stay in that time era, mm-hmm. right? Yeah. And just say thank you for that time. Yeah. <laughs> thank you. Mm-hmm. All right, better original shows. Who you got? Okay, I'm going with MTV for better original show. Better original shows. All right. Yeah. What you, you, what had, you thinking? Um, yeah, Beavis and Butthead. Mm-hmm. You had um, Yo MTV Raps. Celebrity Death Match. Yeah, Celebrity Death Match. Ooh, you, that's hard to beat, bro. That's hard to you beat. Had, Jackass. You had Jackass. Mm-hmm. You had um, Neon Punks. Flux. Ooh, yeah, punked. Aeon Flux was on that too. Yeah. Wow. Mm-hmm. I did not know that. They yeah. had Pimp My Ride too. Pimp My Ride, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And, uh, and everyone's favorite, making the band. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Cambodian breast milk, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Didn't mean to bring him up. Lock him up. Anyway. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. They had a lot of freaking original shows that were like hits. But I'm trying to figure like what shows did BET even have to <laughs> to match this up with because every single show I can think of that's been on BET is from a uh, from another somewhere sh- place uh, some another uh, another, another, another channel yeah BET had borrowed all of their right. shows bro yeah like was I was thinking was the Jamie Fox show did that originate on BET that's or, Fox that was Fox yeah I don't think about I, that was Fox I don't think about rock. But Rock mm-hmm. was on uh, Fox too. Damn! So did they have any of those <laughs> that were worth mentioning? And then when yeah. I was looking through a list, you know, you on Wikipedia looking through like these, these like the posters and shit. I'm like, yeah, who are these people? <laughs> like, who, who are these people? <laughs> this is like a bunch of no name actors and actresses. I was like, ah, oh, skip. <laughs> so you already know I'm going with MTV as well. So that's I'm gonna, yeah. 
my vote for MTV because I was just mm-mm. right. I remember going in watching uh, Celebrity Deathmatch too. I was mm-hmm. like, "Oh, it's Friday, man! We got a new lineup." Yeah, yeah. Pit my ride was was dope with, with X to the Z exhibit. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. Was um oh MTV Cribs? Did you mention that? No, it, that too. MTV, MTV Cribs. Cribs, bro. What's what, yeah. what about Cribs? That was a big thing because everybody was trying to mock it too. MTV's yeah. tr- uh, True Life. <laughs> yeah. God yeah. Dang. MTV had yeah. a lot of shit. A lot, mm-hmm. a lot of TV. Yeah. Punked. Did I mention Punked? You mentioned Punked. Action Kutcher's thing? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. All yeah. of that, man. I'm shocked. I was like, damn, MTV actually had some really good TV. Yeah. Hmm. Sorry there, BET. Lost yeah. points. Yeah. Sorry. All right, moving on. We got uh, better. This one was the, oh, this, this was, was hard. this was hard. Yeah, better music countdowns. Yes, C- countdown shows. Mm-hmm. Okay. So to go yeah. through this, I mean, let's match it up, right? I'm gonna let you go first with it. All right, because BET had 106 and partner. Ah, like, like you can't with, with AJ and free and free. Then you had Rap City with Tigger, Tigger. in the basement. In the base. Rap, 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 rap city. Rap, rap shit, city. Rip, rap, rap shit. city. Mm. Oh my god! Then you had like BET Uncut, like oh. <laughs> the, the, you know when they show the videos. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, <laughs> you, you gotta stay up for oh. that one. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> That's that one was what's supposed to be shown in the video. Yeah. Oh. Okay. You mean that butt was in that video? Okay. Oh my god. Yeah. And then we had and then they even had like gospel shows too, like gospel countdowns. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. They had a bigger like, variety that- of countdowns than I feel MTV. MTV just had total request total request live. For me. No, but think, they right? but they had they, they had they yeah, had yo, yo, MT right. ra- yo MTV yo MTV raps too, but that, yeah. that mm-hmm. Both of those was not playing at the same time. Like MTV Raps was first, and then later on in the nineties, late nineties, uh, Total Request Live. But what about the Rock Countdown? They had a Rock Countdown too. True. Yeah, and then they, I think they had like uh, an you alternative Countdown too. They also had um, this. This is going off with their shows. MTV Unplugged. Yeah. When the, when all the the musicians was 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 recording live. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that was cool. But. I, this is this is hard because like you know BET was mostly African American, right? Right. Like no no white artists could show up on <laughs> on these countdowns. Right. None, none. I say. <laughs> well, yeah, yeah, John B's and yeah, uh, MTV's Alan. like <laughs> no black people could show up on this <laughs> countdown. None, none. I say until <laughs> yeah, that, no, no. MTV did have some uh, MTV, yeah, yeah. MTV had, had some that. blacks. Yeah. Um, because I was thinking like Eminem's videos was mostly MTV, but did he ever show up on a BET count on a like one hundred and six? Yeah, 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 he did. He did. He yeah. did. Okay, yeah. just refreshing my memory. Uh-huh. But they had predominantly more African American artists on BET in their countdown, so that's right. why. Yeah, I, I, this was hard for me because I was like, I kind of liked more of what BET did with their, you know, mm-hmm. reaching out to the black community. But on the flip side, being that the music person that I am, BET, I mean, MTV has a lot of fun videos too, you know. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So I'm going to go with a split here, man. This is too hard for me to decide. Mm-hmm. And I'm going to give one a piece. Okay. Right? Okay. I'm gonna give BT some love right there and MTV. Because I can't live without the other. I, like one cannot be without the other for me. Right. You know? Right. Like after MTV's countdown was done, I was like, all right, 106 and Park is next. Let's go. Like, right. let me go get my African-American culture on. Like, <laughs> who's in True. the black community now? That's at the top of the list. Mm-hmm. Who topped Nelly's hot in hair this week? <laughs> <laughs> that dude was at number one for a minute. <laughs> yeah. Hot in. <laughs> That's oh, all you hear. You're like, hey, I'm good. <laughs> I just switched over from that on MTV. You over here? Dang, no. Oh. <laughs> That's the one video I remember. Anytime you went between BET or MTV, it was Nelly that was on both. Like, God dang. Good job for him. Shout out to Nelly. Maybe I have to throw some flowers at Nelly too one day. Yeah. Do we? Put All that right. on the list. Like, maybe. I'm not writing it. Frank's not here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm if I forgot it, I forgot. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. So what about you? Who are you going for for best music comedy? Uh, I'm going with... Uh, I'm going with BET, man. BET, all right. I'm going with BET. Full on BET. Because of 106 and Park with AJ and Free. In particular... Oh, okay. 
And um, yeah, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. I'm going because just because of, of that. Yeah, that's Did you have I a think, crush on free. Of course, <laughs> <laughs> who didn't? <laughs> who, who did it? <laughs> Duh. <laughs> <laughs> but no, this has nothing to do with that. But I'm just saying, like, I feel like Total Request Live. To be honest, mm-hmm. when I watch their tops top 10 it is always it seemed like it was the same ones it's going to either mm-hmm. be backstreet boys at top three or in sync at top three and then britney spears oh uh, yeah, yeah yeah you know what right, i'm saying right. so so oh god yeah you saw about that era too right with with yeah. christina Aguilera and it's yeah oh, oh i pink. feel like yeah i feel like <laughs> i feel Sorry. like i will watch 106 at park more than total request live okay yeah plus 106 at park had like the the count they had their own little like rap duels too, right? And Rap yeah. City had their little oh man, they had their little freestyle shit. Yeah, too? they had the freestyles, yeah. Okay, uh yeah. Your Honor, I'm gonna like take <laughs> my, I'm sorry. I'm taking that I'm taking that off. No, 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 no. I'm not gonna give that. I'm gonna give my full point to BET, man. I'm gonna give my full point to BET. Yeah. Yeah. So right now it's tied. Screw you, MTV on that one. Right. No, no. I mean that you made a good point right there because most yeah. of the time you knew what the list was gonna play out like. Like Yeah. You know, oops, I did it again. There's it was like, gonna right, eat and play those three. It's gonna be uh, uh, larger than life. And everybody, oh my god, I it in TRL. <laughs> <laughs> it's like you, you're seeing the same stuff again. Right. Yeah. Man. But BET, yeah, I liked it, man. It was. I think it was more fair on BET. Yeah. Unless it was like some some videos like stood there for a while though, for like at least three weeks, but mm-hmm. it didn't last long. Yeah. You know? Yeah. TRL, them shits were there for like months, bro. Like, dang. You see all those, all those people be standing on Times Square, just trying to. What you waiting TRL. at, y'all? At TRL. y'all downstairs? TRL <laughs> upstairs, y'all. <laughs> no, man. Dude, they're watching Sissy the Park. <laughs> this is right down the street. Like, right. <laughs> <laughs> they could go inside, and <laughs> but there's no spots. It's, <laughs> it's all full. <laughs> <laughs> Why'd you guys do yours in a basement? Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to go downstairs with Tigger. No, I don't want to go downstairs oh, with no Tigger. No. <laughs> what do I look like, huh? <laughs> I'm from the Heights. <laughs> well, they got smoke down there. <laughs> I'm from Central Park Ave. I'm not going there. No. <laughs> they do what? They rap? Oh. <laughs> and smoke? Uh uh-uh. uh. No. <laughs> with do rags? No. Nah. You got windows? I seen his thing the other day. He has no windows down there. <laughs> he said with do rags. <laughs> no, I'm going to stay up here. What was, that, what was the host name? I can't remember the name. The host of TRL. You remember his name? Uh, 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 Carson Daly. Carson Daly. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Carson. Yeah. Yeah, Carson Daly like he was tired. Was, hey, here we go, that double top, was... top two. <laughs> Britney Spears hit me, baby, one oh, more time. God. All these freaking preteens and shit all over me. <laughs> I am a thirty-five year old male. And don't y'all have school teams. tomorrow? <laughs> Jeez. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, good, good, good. Uh, convincing me there. I'm yeah. my mind. Yeah, so, yeah. BT better music video, better music countdown. Right. All right. Moving on, we got uh, better original films. This one was uh, l- like a, so, a landslide. So easy. <laughs> this one was easy. <laughs> yeah. MTV. <laughs> MTV man. MTV man. Better MTV. original films. This is another one where I was trying to look through a list and see if and what better, what original films did uh, BET have, dog. <laughs> Medea was Medea. Ho- a holiday Hard. <laughs> <laughs> A holiday Christmas. What? <laughs> what? Who's in it? Trent. <laughs> Who? Trick <Trent>. Daddy. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to see no Trent Daddy in the. Nah, they, no. They had like five movies like uh, What Men Want, Diary of a Mad Black Woman, uh-huh. Nobody's Fool, Love and Murder, Atlanta's Playboy. <laughs> <laughs> and some something else. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. Thank yeah. You. <laughs> thank you. Thank you for that. No. But, but MTV? MTV? On the flip. Ooh, boy. The Longest Yard. Coach jo- Carter. Joe's Apartment. <laughs> uh, Get Rich or Die Trying. Jackass Sick. Films. Oh, my God. Napoleon Dynamite. Oh, Blades of Glory. Mmm. 
Crossroads, Napoleon Dynamite. Booty tag, baby. Booty tag. <laughs> the original hey, Kings of Comedy. Booty too good. Booty too good. Booty too good. MTV too good. <laughs> Beavis and Butthead do America. Come on, the list oh goes on. God. Come on, man. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, MTV was doing it up, man. They they had their shit together with that. Yeah. Oh uh, wait, did you mention Kings of Comedy? That was BT. Yeah. That was a BT. No, that was MTV. Oh shit, they stole them. <laughs> <laughs> that was MTV. They stole them. Yeah. Damn. See, MTV had more money. Yeah. <laughs> MTV had more of the, the white dollars. <laughs> At Total Request Live dollars. <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh yeah sorry baby B T. like yeah i don't i don't like this to seem like it's black versus white it's yeah yeah but it's it's, it's it's both music <laughs> oh, tv man. shows yes music tv but each has like predominantly one race <laughs> <laughs> more or less MTV is like variety. How about that? I don't need anybody to come and say we racist. Like, no, man, they had all this shit. It's the truth. Life. What you want us to do? They got pooty tag, baby. Like, come on. BT, why does y'all think of pooty tag? Come on, come on. That was there for the taking. Yeah. Joe's apartment, though. That was that's too funny. That that Roach movie. Oh man, that's classic. Singing Roaches. Funky tower. Tower got the funk. <laughs> we haven't reminisced on that yet. We have not. Wait, no, I feel, feel like, like I feel like no, we no, no, talked we about it before. We though. talked about it, but yeah. Because yeah, but because it's dealing with roaches, we don't we don't really talk too much. About nah, it. we don't we, we don't like roaches. We don't like insects nah, here around here. No. All right, moving on. It's moving weird. on. Yeah, <laughs> try to get away. Uh, <laughs> all right, so for the last one, this is a doozy. <sighs> yeah. Better Ooh. award shows. Yeah. You got the BET awards. You got the right. MTV awards. Yeah. Who? You take it away here. I don't know. Okay. Go ahead. See, this one, this one was the hardest one for me because um, both had good award shows, but I feel like one tops the other because of I love movies and mm-hmm. I love, I liked MTV movie awards when, when they, when they was having that movie awards in the nineties. Mm-hmm. And mm-hmm. like you know, all the celebrities was it seemed like they was having more fun doing mm-hmm. those award shows, right? And because you had like uh, Ben Stiller doing all of those, the, like the the Mission Impossible, yeah, skit with Tom Cruise. It seemed like it was more fun, yeah, more entertaining, more entertaining, yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. B T. Go ahead, go ahead. No, no I'm saying in ter- you said you mentioned the movie awards, but in terms of the mu- music awards, what about those? With the music awards, I feel, I still feel like MTV did it big because before BET, I think, I think BET did the the, the DC move. Yeah, where, yeah, where yeah. DC, they was like, Marvel is doing all of this stuff. Let's try to we hurry should. up and catch up. Right, yeah, that's right. what B. That's what. BET did when MTV was doing the music awards because BET never they didn't have a, their own award show for a minute. B, right, uh, MTV had theirs for a long ass long time. time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. Th- yeah, this is gonna trump this. This probably puts it all over here in the landslide. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, this is the landslide because we're going to MTV too. Because yeah. you know me, big huge Michael Jackson fan. Right, mm-hmm. like, that dude killed it. Yeah, at these MTV music awards shows, man. Yeah, like for years. Hmm. You had Michael Jackson doing that for years, mm-hmm. and then all of their their stuff like had so much more flair. It was and it, it was, was like big budget, like yeah. It I was can remember the, the 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 Britney Spears when she did yeah that that, that, that what's shit. that that snake yeah that snake yeah. stuff <laughs> yeah yeah <laughs> when she kissed Madonna <laughs> when she kissed Madonna yeah yeah that whole thing that whole yeah thing. I remember all that yeah. It's a bigger, it's a bigger scene. Like also, you said, even the movie awards too. Like I, I forgot how like I used to actually watch. I never was a huge award like, show now, person. Yeah, yeah. Nowadays we definitely don't watch. <laughs> no, but back then I we used to watch these. Like this, yeah. these were actually a good event to watch. Right, they had like best kiss or, or best fight scene. Yeah, like, they had really good categories. You too. never had no like you know movie awards where they. Specifically about just movies, like just right categories about movies. You know what I'm saying? So they got they got better categories than this podcast. <laughs> right, exactly, <laughs> exactly. Yeah, 
yeah. took inspiration from <laughs> BET by, by MTV, by the way. We, right. Like, How do we do this? <laughs> A better <inspired>. music. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so definitely MTV wins all around here. BET's only got two votes from us. MTV yeah. now is on six. Yeah. Uh, if you feel the need to contribute and give BT some points when you hear this clip, feel free to do so because yeah. you know. Mm-hmm. But it is what it is. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> like, yeah, yeah. BET to me, you have 106 in Park, Rap City. Right. That about encompasses all I need to know. Mm-hmm. That's good. What else did you have to offer? Right. And then as the years went by, MTV got more ridiculous and mm-hmm. BET got more. I don't know. Oh man, they all, they both just went just downhill, man. Down, just so bad. Just uh, the just quality a, of everything. MTV was MTV was a lot of uh, sixteen and pregnant, and BET oh, was a lot of Tyler Perry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's not a good mix. Nah, that's what actually probably when I stopped watching TV. <laughs> I was like, yeah, I <laughs> yeah. think I'm good. <laughs> I'm waiting I'm for a dying. poultry streaming service to come out. <laughs> I think I'm gonna come back. Yeah. 2024? 25? Yeah. yeah. It has finally come. <laughs> yeah. I'm surprised. I mean, but they have money, so they're still going. But the, yeah. the amount of trash that's out, I know there's only one kind of person that's loving these shows still. It's really good. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> it, it, it's really good. Cool. Cletus, come on here, man. That shit really good. Cool. Come on over, right. please. <laughs> Well, that does it right there on our Versus. Congratulations, MTV. And yes. thank you once again to both programming sh- for all that you've contributed to the entertainment world. For sure. Ooh, that was a handful to say. Mm-hmm. All right, moving on. We got a... GPs, Comics Corner, yeah. GPs. Come on. Comics Corner, yeah. GPs. Come on. GPs. Yeah. Wow, wow. Yeah. GPs. Yeah. Comics Corner. <sighs> Comic. Comics GPs back. Corner. Yes. Once again, he's got his chair set up with his footstool. He's going <clears> to <throat> talk to us about another mm-hmm. lovely comic mm-hmm. in his corner. What you got this week, Gene? Yes, this week, again, back to back. This uh, this is back to back, right? Yeah. Yeah, back to back. Um, I have Moon Man number one mm-hmm. from Image Comics. Writers Scott Kid Cuddy. Kid Cuddy. Miss Cuddy. Me cut it. Miss, me cut it. Miss, uh, Miss Cuddy. Uh, me, cut uh-huh. it. <laughs> me cut it. You cut it. Who cut it? Uh, yes. Um, and uh, Kyle Higgins and artist um, Marco Katie. Akati. Whichever. <laughs> Whichever. I'm sorry. Mm-hmm. Um, and it's about Raymond is ready for a quiet life. Whenever went wrong on the failed moon mission. Whatever happened in those missing minutes, the cameras didn't capture. All he really wants to do is settle down back home. But those missing minutes holds a earth shattering secret. And with all eyes turned to him, Raymond will soon find himself becoming something the world has never seen before. Okay. Damn. So, I'm Mr. So. Rager. I'm sorry, his name isn't Rager. He said Ray. I was like, oh, Rager. Raymond. Mr. Raymond. Man. Yeah. Hey. That's it. Yeah. 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 But yes, um, uh, it starts off with um, Raymond is um, it been like two months after the mission, but like uh, all the scientists at this aerospace Convention? system company called Janice. Mm-hmm. It's monitoring all the astronauts, and they checking on them. You know, just checking in on to see if they're okay, because mm-hmm. they seven minutes pass and nobody knows what happened. Not even the astronauts so, know what happened. So they're missing. They, they're missing. They're memories missing from footage. Seven minutes. They're missing footage and memories for seven minutes out there. Oh damn! Yes. Was he smoking? <laughs> <laughs> we are, 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 are. Seven minutes off. Can they make your mind burp? burp. burp. Uh, God dang it, Cuddy, we're on a space mission. What but yes, uh, yes, the, they they finally let them release back on uh, 
Earth and everyone's going home. Now, this Janus Aerospace Center is kind of like NASA, but that is in Cleveland. Like, their base is in Cleveland, of course. Mm-hmm. And yeah. this place is being ridiculed as, like, you know, like a, a company that's trying to steal everything, like money and everything, and not paying mm-hmm. the folks because it, it, it basically got different companies and all that just working for that that space station so it's a monopoly of space exploration sort of okay but raymond is heading home and he hasn't seen his brother in years his brother his younger brother got beef with him because raymond is working for that company and that company is basically like i said stealing all the assets and all that stuff resources so he hates him because he's corporate <laughs> right. He's corporate and, and, and mm. everyone down here is trying to fight to fight, you know, compensation and stuff like that. Yeah. Mm. And they start to do riots. Right. Their their uh, parents died a while back, a long time ago. And he also mad him because he left. He basically left. Man on the moon. Man on the moon. He gone. He mm. left his brother behind. So he come back home. And they got a little beef. He said, I'm about to go to this uh, protest. So basically, he said, let me know if you're okay at the protest because they get rowdy out there. So to go ahead. Did he figure out, did they figure out yet what happened to them in those seven minutes? This is the, nah, first, issue, this is the right? first issue I'm talking about. So they, yeah, they don't only. know what happened. They don't know what happened. Everyone <laughs> curious and trying to figure out what happened. Like I said, they was testing out all the astronauts that was aboard mm-hmm. in those seven minutes and it was seen if they're okay because they don't know what happened Ooh. right so mm. his brother go into the protest and something happened at the protest where police is you know you know cr- how crazy a protest gets mm-hmm. so he goes there in gear he goes there in in, in old pilot testing gear that so no one won't see who he is because mm-hmm. you know the town know who he is because you know he's on the news and all that stuff and right and when they touch so he's down trying to keep his his identity on low right so he gets he goes there he see his is his brother about to be attacked by the police and he do this super jump almost flight oh dang and it's it's pretty cool how they you know, how they show it how you do it Mm-hmm. Um. So, and he get his brother out of there, and it's probably like you know what you just did, and blah 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 blah. He said you're a you superhero. Got powers. Exactly, <laughs> right. This he, he, <laughs> <laughs> but uh, I don't. I don't think he knows. I think, I think he kind of knows what happened because y'all he he be blacking out mm-hmm. throughout his trip back home. Is certain blackouts where he just just drift off. And, he can't and have images of the moon. But wow. he can't remember what happened. And he don't think nothing's wrong. But when his brother said, you got powers, mm-hmm. he still can't really believe it. And he said, you could do something about this. You can, you could turn things around. And he mm-hmm. said, I am not a superhero. And basically, that's oh. how it ends with that issue. Wow. So yeah. It seems like Kid Cudi got his wish. He, he created a dope-ass freaking comic. Yeah. He's like it. He's he's into this cool stuff too, like anime and all that other stuff. So, yeah, I'm not surprised he went the superhero route here. Mm-hmm. It seems like not, he's going sorry, to that's superhero. A, not superhero. It, it seems, seems very. It seems superhero-y, like uh-huh. the origins per se. Origin story. Okay. Yeah, yeah. The way like, the way I think he's gonna have to go against the the man as far as and the man is that 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 um, space he center. Take down the corporation. And Possibly figure out some. Weird ass alien snuck up in them. <laughs> hey, hey. <laughs> nice. Yeah. So, what do you give the comic as you've read it? The first issue. I give the first issue a eight out of ten. And I give it an eight out of ten because I feel like it was it was a f- quick read. It feel like like he he came back to Earth. They tested him. He went home, and in protest, he got powers. End of issue one. 
I feel I like mean, give him, yeah, yeah, I know, give but I'm some slack. It's his first <laughs> I know, but I'm just, I'm just saying, I, I wanted more in the issue than what mm. I got. That's it. Got you. Okay. I, I'm not saying but, it's bad. I'm just saying I just wanted more in in the issue. In the first one, at yeah. least they got you wanting to continue to read, though. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna get uh, the so, next issue. Kid Cudi, this is his first comic ever. Yeah, and it just came out. Yeah. Okay. Wasn't oh, wasn't his character a, a, a comic artist in that in that um, CGI in, film in in that movie right in um uh, in the well, that's on Netflix yeah yeah, yeah, yeah intergalactic yeah he was so that's what yeah. I'm saying like it looks like Kid Cudi's dream has has come to fruition here like yeah I'm happy for him yeah good job mm-hmm. Kid Cudi Shoot. yeah that's cool clap it up there for Kid Cudi Damn. yeah that for is sure. awesome. Mm-hmm. Look out for that, Moon Man. Moon Man. Had three albums about this man, damn it. <laughs> <laughs> now he's got a comic about him. Finally. <laughs> hey. Who are you talking about? Now you know. Mr. Raymond. <laughs> hey. <laughs> hey. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We're going to call it there on the comics corner. Yes. We'll call it Thank the... you for sharing. No problem. That was, that's definitely a dope one, man. Mm-hmm. I wish I read comics like how you do. I know. Uh, you can't. Yeah, it's, I yeah. can't. I'm, I'm a gamer, though. So yeah. I, I can't. <laughs> <laughs> ooh, ooh, yeah. ooh, ah. <laughs> All right, let's slow it down some. Yeah. Drop it low. Turn Ooh. your TV down. Real down. Step away from your Chick fil A. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Get it? Step away from Chick fil A. Chick fil A. Positive. Chakra. Chakra. Yeah. I got it this week. Here we go. Your good mood is like a sunrise. Not everyone will see it, but those who do will be incredibly thankful for it. I'll say that again. Your good mood is like a sunrise. Not everyone will see it, but those who do will be incredibly thankful for it. Mm-hmm. So shine, shine, shine. Keep shining. Sun do shine, sun do shine, sun do shine, sun do shine. Sun do shine. <laughs> Your good mood is in like a sunrise. Everybody see it. Though. <laughs> That's a call of reminisce. Shout out, baby. Shout out. Yes. Spread those good moods, man. Spread them everywhere. Spread them on the moon. Yep. <laughs> spread them in the spread them in the chicken restaurant. Yeah. Spread them while you pulling your nose. Ah, pause. Wait, that is uh, <laughs> wait, <laughs> wait, 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 wait. I'm sorry. Pulling Spread your the nose. Spread the smile. Smile. Smile while you're have a good mood while you're pulling your nose. Not ah, jerking your that nose. Still does, that pulling. still doesn't sound good. <laughs> Dang. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. We're failing. I'm sorry. Abort. <laughs> Hit the siren. Abort. Aborting. Oh no. 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 Oh god. Yes, but let that <laughs> positivity shine out. Yeah. To all those who in need. Mm-hmm. All right. Any yellows before we head out to go play Volga? Um, yes. Um, happy birthday to AD and Big W. Hey, that's me. Yeah, and Big W. That, that's yeah. him. That guy. Yeah, a friend. <laughs> thank um, you. You know what? I want to throw in something else before. No. You, like, thank you for the shout out. But Vegas also was like a birthday present too. You know, so it's true I, for both. I, I yeah, 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 yeah. It was like yeah. a birthday celebration of the month. So. You had the Buffaloes. He had. Um, yeah. Um, what's that guy named? Chris. Chris Angel. Yeah. That yeah. There you go. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I had the buffaloes. <laughs> yeah. You had the buffaloes. You had that. Yeah. There we go. All yeah. right. Yeah. Thank you. All right. Continue. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> um. Um. Rest in peace to mm. Fat Man Scoop. Mm. Tragic man. Tragic. That man. one. That one hurt. That's a childhood yeah. favorite right there. That was. That was a shock when I heard that man. <laughs> Moment of silence for Fat Man Scoop. Thank you for all of your contributions to the yes. hip-hop entertainment industry, man. For sure. <sighs> yeah. Yeah, that, that one hit hard today. Yeah, man. Jeez. Yeah. Hip-hop world, we, we, we're well, there with you. <laughs> we're there with you. Yeah. Any other yells? That's all the yells I have for this week. All righty. Uh, I'm going to yell out everyone who, you know, reached out, messaged, hit me up, wh- whichever way, form, fashion, for the birthday. Thank you so much. Thank you, GP, for, you know, the trip with Vegas. <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was a really great birthday, man. Like, uh, you know, at this stage of life, you just be thankful for who's around. And right. Just 
life. Like celebrate, yeah. yeah You're breathing. Challenges and stuff you've gone through, and right. we're here now. It's like, mm-hmm. okay. You know, yeah. we're doing okay. Yeah. Um, yeah, thankful for the wife. And she just, oh my gosh. Like, I wasn't expecting really much. You know, right. I was like, I was good after Vegas. And yeah. she just came through in the clutch and made it really a good day. And I was like, mm-hmm. wow, thank you. Damn. <laughs> this is just, that shocks me. Um, and also, shout out to my uh, third grade team once again for holding it down and celebrating and whatnot. Uh, mm-hmm. I wasn't expecting that either. <laughs> so, so, yeah. I was expect- I was going to go on Black Wukong, man. Like, I got to <laughs> play a little few extra hours. <laughs> but this is great. <laughs> this is good. I like this. So, yeah, shout out to them, man. They're good peoples, man. They are good peoples. Yeah. If I could merge everybody into like one big party, this that you know that's probably what I'll do for my fortieth birthday. One, uh, one huge party, huh? One huge ass party on the moon. <laughs> <laughs> Here's your spacesuit. <laughs> now don't jump too high when the base comes on. <laughs> yeah. We're gonna go fly. <laughs> you don't want to get drift off in space. I'm not gonna catch you. Okay, yeah. there was a waiver for you to sign for this party. Buddy. Right, right. You did. Yeah. All righty. So that was that guy known as GP. Yeah. And that was that guy known as AD. AD. And this is what we do each week. We talk on the mic and then we speak. Call it like I don't. Call it like I don't. Call it podcast. Call it podcast. Call it podcast. Call it. Call it podcast. Call it podcast. Call it podcast. Call it podcast. Then Frankie chose us to leave, and that's why. <laughs> but don't worry about it, cause he'll be right on back on next that's, week that's, episode. That's, that's, Episode, episode, <laughs> episode. <laughs> I missed that movie. Listen, folks, you've ever realized by now, this is what we do. Yes. <laughs> and now it's time for us to pay some dues and play some Black Myth Wukong. Wukong. I got the monkey stick that's going to break your neck. <laughs> Wukong. <laughs> so we will catch you all in check on the flippity flop. Peace. Deuces. <laughs>